Well, people are sounding the alarm after a number of bizarre incidents on a South Charlotte Greenway. CMPD says in the last 48 hours, it has received over a dozen calls about a man exposing himself on the Four Mile Creek Greenway. WCNC Charlotte's Austin Walker joining us live from there tonight. Austin, people tell you this has been happening for weeks, though. Yeah, so people have been saying that their neighborhood groups have been posting an alert about this, saying a man has been coming up to them and also exposing and touching himself inappropriately. Obviously, a serious situation, and now they're just searching for answers from CMPD. A situation unexpected by many. Shocked, immediately shocked and a little horrified. In the last 48 hours, CMPD says they've received dozens of calls about a man exposing himself to people at the Four Mile Creek Greenway in South Charlotte. It is sad, um, but unfortunately it's our reality. But for Seema Taig, she's walked the Greenway weekly for the last five years, and there's been moments where she's felt unsure and unsafe. One time I just, you know, walked by and I had this feeling. I looked back and the guy who was sitting on the bench was standing up with his camera pointing at me. And when I walked towards him, he just kind of ran away. Here today to inform you all. Moments like these aren't uncommon on Charlotte Greenways. In the past three months, CMPD addressing a slew of investigations regarding sexual assault and indecent exposure, taking the time to address the public, offering tips on how people can stay safe. Being on the phone with someone, not walking with headphones, um, to yell or scream um, if something happens. Teague says she takes those precautions already, knowing a safe area can quickly change. You just have to be vigilant. You have to walk around. You have to constantly, like, look, you know, just be aware of your surroundings. So while awareness is key, people wish a walk on the greenway could be as simple as just enjoying the peaceful escape of nature. It reminds me of walking on the farm at home. Now, obviously, if you know anything, CMPD asks for you to call 911 so they can get a suspect description so stuff like this doesn't happen anymore. For now, we're live in South Charlotte. Austin Walker, WCNC Charlotte. Absolutely. Austin, thanks for that report. Yeah. On Friday, Mecklenburg County Parks and Rec is introducing new signs on greenways to help walkers and runners better identify their location, hopefully to help with the situation we just talked about, but they can also help that with first responders and make sure that they can get there faster.